edition of ABC7 News. Because of the NHL playoffs, I'm Dion Lin. This is a day designed to inspire and support action worldwide to take better care of the environment. ABC7 News reporter Cornell Bernard is live for us in San Rafael with a look at how some people honored the earth and Cornell on this gorgeous day. I'm sure people were out on the water. Yes, they were land and water both, uh, Dion. Nothing was off limits. In fact, this canal here in San Rafael, a little bit cleaner today along with neighborhoods and shorelines across the Bay Area, thanks to an army of Earth Day volunteers. Looks like a chair. One gentleman found a uh, printer, actually, rather large printer. Tom Nasdam is showing us just some of the debris fished out of the San Rafael Canal by his customers on Earth Day. Forty people got a free kayak or paddleboard rental from 101 Surf Sports if they set a course for trash above and below the water. And many returned with a lot of weird stuff. I've been doing this for 12 years, and uh, it's been awesome. Each year, you know, we build on participation and uh, definitely help clean up the canal. What are we looking for? Look, another bottle cap. Victoria Hansen and her son Mateo were taking part in this Earth Day litter cleanup at Shorebird Park in Berkeley. I'm trying to teach him how important it is to try to take care of our Earth um, because it's uh, it's just a little uh, scary, you know? We've got to take care of it. It's the only one we got. So what kind of things are you finding? All kinds of stuff. <laughs> Lots of plastic. Organizers say 200 people came out for the event to make the park a little cleaner and help keep plastics out of the bay. With a small action like this, uh, I think like we've all come together uh, and really step forward, uh, we can make a difference. In San Jose, volunteers were cleaning up neighborhoods across the city to combat litter and blight. Preserving the environment with clean air and water in the midst of climate change is the goal of many across the globe. The cool afternoon fog rolled in over the Golden Gate, a reflection of our amazing Bay Area microclimates. There was a lot of trash being collected in nearby Golden Gate Park near the San Francisco Earth Day Festival, where all things sustainable, recyclable, and vegan were being celebrated. We wanted to keep the focus on having reusable, sustainable goods so we can show people how easy it is to be environmentally conscious these days. And we wanted to have a lot of vegan food as well so people can taste how, how delicious it is to, to go plant-based. Yeah, lots of takeaways from that festival, including uh, lessons on reducing our carbon footprint, even composting. Many folks we talked to today were thrilled to see the participation Bay Area-wide and all that trash being hauled away. Many believe that Earth Day should be every day. Live in Burren County, Cornell Bernard, ABC 7 News. As it should. All right, Cornell, many